Jason from Gadget Coach, and today we're talking about restrictions on your Apple devices, so iPod, iPhone, iPad. So to access these restrictions, great parenting controls built by Apple, go to settings on your device, scroll to general, and one more to restrictions. Currently you can see they're set to off, so we're going to switch those to on by pressing enable restrictions. Quick choice of a passcode, this will be different to the security code on your device, so a different parenting uh, pin code, so your child will not know this. Any of these apps or functions here, if you switch them to off, those options actually just won't appear in the software, such as Safari for internet browsing. To control explicit content in music and podcasts, you can take that off, as simple as switching that button. Go back, in-app purchases are a really important one. Kids games often have these options to purchase extra credits. The kids might not actually realize that that put a charge on your credit card. So you can switch that to off nice and simply. Privacy, you can control what sort of information might be shared through certain apps such as location services, broadcasting through, through maps and other games. Also Twitter and Facebook, if those accounts are set up at all, you can restrict changes to those. Plus the general accounts on the phone such as email and also multiplayer games and adding friends through Game Center just to know who your child's interacting with. So there's a brief look at restrictions on your iOS devices. For more information or to get in touch, gadgetcoach.com.au. We'd love to hear from you or join us on Facebook or Twitter, both usernames Gadget Coach. Thank you very much. It's easy with Gadget Coach.